Since first we were left for dead, now we're left for the vermin to die. In a tide. Yes. And now we made friends with dwarves. So, win-win. Yep. It's vermin tide. Two. Yes. And really feels like Left 4 Dead with fantasy characters and melee attacks and rats. Naked rats in mines and yeah, it's a lot of fun. I mean, it feels like you were saying it's more like an action slash game than a hack and slash game. Hack and slash. Did I say hack and slash? Action slash, yeah. Action slash. Yeah. Action this slash. This is actually a game that we wanted to play for a long time, but unfortunately we just couldn't um, for months and years, and finally we have the chance. So this is a good a game. I really like it. Mm -hmm. And there's actually we only finished the prologue, so I think there's at least four to six hours of gameplay you can go through, and then there's two expansions as well you can buy. Um, that can make it even more uh, six to eight hours. Yeah, and it's really cool, like there's power-up attacks and lots of different melee attacks that you can do. Uh, and there's potions. It really feels, honestly, like it felt like a sequel to Left 4 Dead, just different characters and NPCs are to help out too. And uh, yeah, there's barrels of sort It feels like, what if you had like Doom meets fantasy? Instead of the demons, yeah. you fight rats. Exactly. Or like these are like deadly rats. Yeah. Um, what about the story? Was it really? I don't think there was. We skipped the story, yeah, but it was basically like um, you were a prisoner. You were broken out with your friends, and you're basically leading this attack against these vermin. These uh, they, a race of rats called the Skaven. Yeah. And like, I think you would even enjoy this game even more if you were a fan of Warhammer, but I mean, if you like fantasy in general, then you're going to enjoy this game. And I think at some point, the rats have found a means to get into our, I mean, to get into the human realm. Yeah. Because they had like this large gate. We actually up. had to pull ourselves away from this game. That's how much fun this game was. Yeah, we had to like agree like, that, this is like with uh, Metal Gear Solid Five, where we agreed that the prologue, we were going to have to stop the prologue. Yeah. Because otherwise we'd be spending hours at this game. Yeah, we'd probably play the whole game through and it's like, oh, it's 5 o'clock, oh, it's on the five. oh, we should break, well, it's on now. How does this game compare to that other Left 4 Dead style game we played? Um, Doom Patrol, um, Fortune Brigade? Oh, Strange Brigade. Yeah. Yeah, Strange Brigade, that's the interesting thing. Strange Brigade feels more like Uncharted with like zombies and sort of scorpions. I don't know, it feels like Uncharted meets Indiana Jones to me with a bit of Left 4 Dead. Whereas um, this is... And more puzzles and this is like flat out action. That's what I, that's my perception of this. Yeah, this game feels so cool, like just hacking. And this is just one character. The other yeah. characters seem to play differently. Like you have and, a character... And this one character managed to ooze out buckets and buckets of blood. Like this is definitely not a game for kids. So <laughs> yeah. This like, is not a kiddie no con game. Like the first character you, like one of the characters you come across is literally blowing herself up, like flaming everyone. <laughs> yeah, and you get arrows, so if you really want to like rub dirt into the wound, then you could just fire arrows at people that are While they're fire. burning so, alive. <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty grim game actually. The, well, for the prologue, it's like... <laughs> well, this game is uh, made in the same universe as the... As the People who originate the term of Grim Dark. Yeah. Um, okay, that's 40k, but still. Yeah, it's it's a lot of fun. I can imagine this game be even better if you're playing with friends. Like it just it feels like a like an adventure game almost in that sense. Like if you're playing with friends, I feel like because we're only playing a solo, we won't get the full uh, scope of the game. But even which, then, like playing this game solo feels a lot more. Uh, feels a lot more adventurous than if you played Left 4 Dead or Strange Brigade on your own. Yeah, yeah, it definitely does. It definitely feels like they, they spent the time like with dwarves singing as they're going to their doom and just all those nice little touches I found that they added to this game that made it... Uh, yeah, it definitely feels like it is set in this universe mm -hmm. that has been established for generations. Mm -hmm. And I've seen some of the levels that come up later, like I think there's some town levels and they look amazing. Uh, just make sure the gamma's not too high because when we first started, like everything was like a whitish gray. 
like too much uh, blue, and then we toggled down to like near the bottom, and it's like uh, that's well halfway bad. three point yeah. four. Yeah. So I highly recommend it. I say if you can get it, it was on Humble Bundle for like ten dollars. This is ten out of ten for me. Yeah, I give it definitely a nine out of ten. Um, without knowing like how long the game is. I do. But it's a lot of fun. I do recommend though you play this with a controller because. Yeah. It feel like most of the games we play feel good with a controller, but this game I feel feels like it was designed for a controller for a mouse. I feel. Yeah, which is weird to say for me to say, but uh, yeah, definitely, definitely check. It I out. don't it's feel like I could play this with a keyboard. Is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's the next step. We have to try that next. So we should mention that this game does feel a little difficult. It feels a little bit difficult. It doesn't feel like center when we're playing, but. Uh, um, yeah, it's definitely like a really impressive game. We had the settings on Extreme, and it laid smoothly. Was, yeah, the laptop was. I mean, it was heating up, Alma. but yeah. So, all right, check this game out. Ten out of ten. Check it. Can't wait for the third one. Now let's sure. scurry away like the rats we are. Like the Skaven. All right, like this game. keep on gaming. <laughs> Bye.